Oh my god, oh my god, oh my gosh. Ah, I cannot believe it. I shouldn't even be happy about this. I should be sad, right? I know y'all probably like, girl, what is going on? Mama, going crazy again. Y'all, I cannot believe it has been over two months, almost three months. The last video I posted was on May 14th, I believe. We are really going on three months, y'all. So I say, you know what, girl, get your ish together and sit on this camera and let them know where you been, what's going on, why you stopped posting, what's to come, and all of that stuff. So let's go in order. First of all, y'all, nothing really happened right nothing like happened to where it made me not want to post or not post it was more so of a feeling i enjoy doing vlogs i know y'all love vlogs i really 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 enjoy vlogging right however sometimes vlogging can kind of be a lot when that's the only video you keep posting if you look at the last few videos or the last couple videos i posted since i've been living here it's like a lot of vlogs which i like but it can kind of like you gotta kind of switch it up a little bit i feel like i was taking the easy way out with just doing a vlog and just not really putting the effort into like planning my content or trying to do different kind of content just doing a vlog just doing a vlog and then sometimes it felt like i was like trying to find content to vlog and i didn't like that feeling so i don't remember like what day i decided i'm not gonna post it wasn't even like a decision like oh i'm not gonna post on youtube for two months it was more so of like i just wasn't in the mood like i was just this this really bad funk y'all i was posting on tiktok and you know posting like little shorts on here it was so much easier to post those kind of videos because they're just quick and easy versus like a whole youtube video you gotta edit and all of that it's just completely different i just was in a really bad funk with youtube just not feeling motivated just not feeling like i knew what i wanted to post not planning it not figuring shit out it just wasn't it and then once one month passed it just was like oh well shit uh, i guess we could just keep this going <laughs> it's not funny but i got comfortable i got too comfortable with not posting it honestly started off at like two weeks first i was like dang i gotta post a video then it came to a month i'm like dang i gotta post a video then it's like okay it's about a month and a half now what you doing and i was like oh yeah let me just do these little quick tiktoks let me just do tiktok 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 and it was like, okay, it got to a point where you can't avoid it no more. I tend to only do stuff when I feel motivated and happy to do it. I wasn't really in like a super happy, motivated space. So I didn't want to like come on camera acting like I'm happy. And y'all know my personality. I'm not going to fake it. So it would have been able to be seen through the camera to y'all. I mean, I was dealing with my own personal stuff in my personal life, which I don't really care to get into. It was more so just feeling in the funk, feeling like I don't know what to post, honestly. And then y'all, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, I low key was like, man, I should just start over. I should just delete my YouTube channel and start from zero. Girl, my mind was going, okay? My mind was going, I just felt like, since I've been on YouTube, y'all, which I just reached 5,000 subscribers, which I'm going to address in a minute, but if you've been here for a while, I started out just posting stuff on YouTube just to post stuff on YouTube. Like, oh, let me just do this. Let me just do this. Let me just do that. Oh, this look like people like this. Oh, let me just do that. It was never because of things that I was like genuinely passionate about. It was like fun and it was trendy at the time. And I'm like, oh, let me just do this. Oh, let me just do this. Oh, let me just, you know what I'm saying? Versus like really sitting down, figuring out what my people want to see what i want to personally put out there that feels comfortable to me and genuine to me and just i don't know just maybe plan things and map things out better versus just posting here and there oh then i'm gonna go away then i'm gonna post again then i'm gonna go away then i'm gonna put you get what i'm saying like it just it just haven't been given all oh, these last four years so i kind of got to the point where so maybe i'm like maybe i should start over maybe i should delete my channel but then i'm like no maybe you should not delete your channel because you've had your channel for four years you need to stop comparing yourself to other people and just shift gears a little bit that's pretty much it so that's really a jits of why i haven't been posting now to get into um my 5,000 subscribers y'all thank y'all so much so i reached 5,000 subscribers i think the day 
after or the day before my one year mark in Houston. I think that was on the 17th, I reached 5,000 subscribers. So I was so happy y'all. I even started to vlog a little bit, but then it just went away. I did reach my 5,000 subscribers mark, which I'm so, 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 so grateful for y'all. So grateful. Then just feeling hard on myself too about like, dang, some people that's been doing YouTube for four years, they got way more than 5,000. Like just thinking like that, y'all, just being negative, just being negative, which is not normal for me. The next day I reached my one year mark in Houston, which has been crazy to me like one year already has went by is really crazy but then i started thinking about dang it's been a year what have i done i didn't do everything i said i wanted to do it's just like girl relax some things that i've been up to let's talk about that i have been doing things you know i've been posting like i said on tiktok a little bit i kind of cleaned it up now because i want to like revamp my tiktok i am going to a new gym now 24 hour fitness which i'm excited about i've been going there for a little over two weeks love it down i went to raleigh north carolina literally this past weekend to go see my sister for her birthday so we had a ball out there girl honestly y'all i have been really wasting my days like to be honest, like I be laying around a lot, just scrolling on my phone for too long, getting distracted at work. Girl, it's just been a lot. It's been a lot and it's just not me. So I don't think I'm like, I was depressed or anything like that. I didn't feel no type of depression or like super sad. It wasn't that. It was really just being lazy. Like if you really want to call a spade a spade, just being lazy. I do want to go over like some things I want to start shifting on my channel so y'all can kind of know what y'all are getting yourself into or what to expect so i want to continue to still post vlogs but not as consistently as i have been like not just back to back to back to back to back so the stuff that i want to start incorporating now on my channel is more like things that i'm super passionate about that i do on a day-to-day -day basis y'all know i love the gym y'all know i love eating i love cooking healthy food just motivational tips on how i got to the stage that i'm at now with my fitness journey and just growing as a woman tips with just woman to woman kind of things like I feel like I want to get y'all more in tune of like things that I'm really passionate about y'all know that I go to the gym and work out and stuff but y'all don't really see all of it you know what I'm saying and this is stuff that I literally wake up every day and do cheers to the fact that I'm back on YouTube y'all and cheers to the fact that I have a planner now y'all like I had a planner for my bills but girl I got a planner for the content girl because I gotta get it together honey okay so cheers to y'all cheers to that and let's take a sip mm. I feel like I covered everything i haven't really been doing a whole lot of things so let me know uh in the comments below what kind of videos y'all want to see around that field that i told y'all i want to kind of stay within anyway i'm happy i'm excited i'm back and we back like no we back like we never left we gonna say that ah! see y'all in the next video peace